Round of applause for Zara Spring Collection. Ooh, it's a doggy. Have you got pops? Oh shit, no, I need to go get Bobby. <laughs> you need to go get my dog, thank you. I was just gonna come home about <laughs> Can you hear that? That's my dummy. <laughs> Anyway, this haul is an excuse for you if you've not ordered from Zara in like two days. Congrats. But look at the packaging. It's pink. Hey honeys, welcome back to a, another Sunday upload. Thanks for returning. If you're new here, hi my name is Zoe, I'm 25 and I live on the Isle of Skye with my boyfriend Fakar. We've just recently bought a house. So I'm filming from what will be my dressing room. Today I thought I'd bring you a Zara haul, another one because who doesn't love Zara, especially in spring, without realising most things are actually pink. So today is technically a pink Zara summer haul. For a pink hot girl summer, yes you can have a hot girl summer if like me you are taken, have a partner, boyfriend, girlfriend, doesn't mean you can't have a hot girl summer. I think we all deserve a hot girl summer, so go buy that dress, go buy those shoes, treat yourself. Like I need any encouragement. <laughs> I just got some new summer pieces which I'm very excited to wear and I thought I'd go with the theme of pink. So today I'm wearing my pink cardigan dress and I've got some pink lippy on. So this haul, finally I actually will kick myself up the bottom and film a try on haul for you so this will be a try on haul of all the pieces I picked up from Zara. The past couple of hauls I've just not been feeling trying them on but today I will, it's sunny outside. I also plan on making a TikTok with the new pieces I purchased and if you want to see how I style them don't forget to follow me on Instagram which my name is at Zoe Corrigal. That's where I post all my fashion inspiration outfits. Fashion. I love fashion. So the first piece I picked up from Zara is this poplin shirt in baby pink. They do have this in a like a hot pink but I thought I'd wear this more. The only size they had left was a medium. I mean I guess I was kind of going for the oversized look and to be honest it doesn't actually look too big. Usually I'm an extra small small so medium is fine it's not an extra large and this was $19.99. Not bad for a shirt just your basic shirt but in baby pink. I mean, you cannot get a better shirt. I probably plan on wearing this with like a unitard underneath or some leggings and a vest top and just having this oversized over the top or you, is it long enough? Mm, I don't think it's long enough for a dress. That might be a wee bit risky. So that's the first piece I picked up. Next piece I picked up is some jeans. In pink. <laughs> now do you see what I mean by this is a pink haul? So I got, I didn't actually realise the name of these, these are the new daddy in midsummer pink in Zara denim. I got this in a UK size 8 and they were $29.99. Very weird, the button is silver but the other hardware is like rose gold. I don't know how I feel about that. I wish they just had it all the one colour. But other than that, We'll skip past that. These are, they're not wide legs, I guess they're more straight legs. And they're raw at the bottom, so it makes great for me cutting them because Zara jeans are not petite friendly. If you know, you know. I uh, So I got these pink jeans. I actually haven't tried these on yet, so I don't know if they'll fit. Apparently, if you can fit it around your neck, it'll fit. So if that's the case, it should fit. These are very cute. I'm loving the pastel jean trend this spring and it would be breaking the rules if I didn't buy a pink one because I don't have pink jeans. Next piece I purchased a play suit in a size small and it was $29.99. Almost like a khaki beige. Looks very brown on the camera but it's not. And it's got like wee cut out pieces and a drawstring waist and just goes into shorts. It's almost like a shirt top which is cute. You could like have it on. Could you unbutton it? Yes, it unbuttons. So I thought this was just a nice staple piece for summer wardrobe because you can't go wrong with neutral colours. So I picked up this playset which I love. 
Picking up this play suit, I actually picked up a pair of shoes which I thought would go really well with it. And I love this style of shoe, it gives me holiday vibes. And yet again, I actually don't have a pair like this in my collection. So I picked up these wedges with the clear vinyl strap. I thought these were, I thought these were so cute. I had to pick them up. These definitely give me summer vibes. So I'm ready for summer so I can get my toesies out. Yeah, pick these up in my usual size, UK4. And this vinyl actually feels really soft. So I don't think I'll have a problem with them. And these were 29.99. Yeah, I thought these would go really cute with the play suit and other pieces I've picked up as well. Staying on the shoe theme for now, I also picked up these sandals. I think these were in last year as well in a tan colour. I think we've got them in a few other colours as well, but I like these. These are like ecru coloured. And just a neutral colour that will go with pretty much any outfit. These were $27.99 and I picked these up in a UK size 4. Round of applause for Zara Spring Collection. Woo! I went on the Zara app a couple of weeks ago and found out that they had a new collection which I'm all over and it's the pet collection. I can't believe Zara are doing a pet collection. Like tell me is that not just dreams having a matching jumper with your dog. That's a bit of me. So this is Tika the Iggy. Iggy is an Italian greyhound, if you didn't know. I picked this t-shirt up in a size medium. And look! It's a doggy! It's a doggy! And he's got glasses on and a jumper. Tell me that is not the best t-shirt you've seen all spring. I'm actually obsessed with it. I picked it up in a size medium, just so it was a bit more oversized. And look, I'm actually obsessed with this. It's so cute. I love Iggy's. Love it. I then actually picked up a cord as well. Surprise, surprise. Cord queen over here. So the bottoms are the shorts. They're white, almost like a linen-y feel again. Picked these up in a size medium and these were $19.99. They also have the contrast stitching on the pockets. But yeah, just... Basic white shorts, very stretchy, very comfortable. Pick these up in a size medium. And then the matching top, it's got a very loose fitting neckline. It's actually cropped with an elasticated waist, but I don't think will actually cut your tummy off. Same with the sleeves, and then it's got the contrast bows on the side. I thought that was different. So I picked the top up in a size small and it was $19.99. I'm hoping with the top being cropped and picking up a size medium shorts that I can pull the shorts up quite high because I don't like my midriff hanging out there. But yeah, I thought this was cute for summer and especially where I live on the Isle of Skye. Summers aren't exactly hot hot so longer sleeves is always a win. Next piece I'm actually obsessed with. I cannot wait to wear this out. I think it's maybe a wee bit too much for going to the supermarket. But I don't know, I love it. I picked this up in a size extra small and it was $27.99 and I have seen it all over TikTok, but can you guess what it is? Can you guess by the color? Oh, obsessed with hot pinks this summer. It's the shirt dress. I love shirt dresses and especially this one with the elasticated waist so it cinches you in. I'm obsessed. Well, yeah, I just said shirt dress. It technically is a shirt dress because the material doesn't actually have buttons down the front, which I like. It's cute. And it's got your collared neckline and your shirt sleeves with a button. I'm just obsessed with this. And the fact it has an elasticated waist, like look how stretchy she is. Ladies and gentlemen, her. Next piece, I picked up a midi dress and I absolutely hate the hanging ties on these. These ones are huge. So this piece is a midi rib dress in this creamy ecru colour, very neutral, but you've got your kind of halter neck, halter neck neck. <laughs> but if you turn it around, the straps, the back goes quite low, but not, not too low, but the straps do cross over at the back which I actually didn't realise, but it's a really nice touch, especially for summer. And I picked this one up in a size small, and I've already taken the tag off. 
and I can't remember how much it was. I want to say something around 20 quid, which for this is not bad. It's not the thickest dress, but it's not see-through and it's not super duper thin. Next piece, I don't know why I'm buying another pair because I definitely do not need to add more to my collection. Sunglasses. I like these, I like the off-white kind of creamy frame, the black lenses. These were 25 99 which is not bad for sunglasses, I don't think. And they're UV protected, which is always good. It's funny, I don't think I suit square frames from the front. These are not square, they're rectangular. That's quite cute. I always don't think I suit them from like close up, if you can see me, but I, I always like it looking from the side. <laughs> or on your head. They always look cute on your head. I did have to turn the notifications on for when these came back in stock because these went out pretty quickly. They also came with a case and a fabric case on the inside as well. Neutral to go with all my neutral outfits this summer. And last piece that I picked up, when I first saw these on the website, I actually really didn't like these, but seeing them on people, I fell in love very quickly. These went out of stock so fast because they were all over TikTok, but it's the quilted padded flip flops and I got them in the Eat Crew kind of creamy colour. In my usual size UK4, these were €29.95, Euros, so I don't know how much these were. They were either something like £25.99 or £29.99. But yeah, love these. I actually cannot wait to wear them. I've not worn them yet, but that is so soft. I can't wait. They, I think they look huge, but with the right outfit, I think they'll look really cute. So yes, very happy that I did manage to nab a pair of these. And that's my haul done. That's my pink Zara haul done. Thank you guys so much for watching yet another one of my videos. I really do appreciate it. If you did like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and to hit that subscribe button for more Zara hauls definitely in the future. It's one of the shops I absolutely love. So thank you so much again for watching and we'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Mwah.